Wait, what's wait. he? Let's, whoa, 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 wait, wait, what? It's glitching, it's glitching, it's... <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to Clownfish TV Gaming. I'm here, this is uh, Neon, I'm here with uh, my daughter, Pinky Boo. Today we're playing Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator or FNAF 6. Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator. Was there any, any clue that this was going to come out? It just sort of like happened. I mean, people were talking about it, but I, I thought that it wasn't going to happen. And then this came up and I'm like, oh my gosh, we have to do this for the channel. Okay, well, so like, my dad bought it. So it looks, it looks like the graphics took a hit big time. So. It looks like an old 80s game. It does. It looks like an old 80s computer game. So let's try it. Let's hit enter and see what happens. So we can design pizza or go to pizzeria. Okay, so you just pick that pizza so, and you go up or down. Okay, so you can't use the mouse on this. No, because this is like a really old game. Okay, so what, we're designing pizza. Um, oh, now, oh, you now can we can use the mouse. Pepperoni, olives, sausage, and onions. But no, onions. I, I'm just putting what I like on my pizza. I think that's good, guys. Okay, so press enter and see what happens. Now we can design, go to our pizzeria. Okay, so, okay, so um, what are we doing? Oh, okay, so it's, yeah, this looks like an old arcade game. It's actually and pretty then cool. shift to. Okay. So, where so are we trying to feed these guys the pizzas? Is that what's going on? Yeah. Okay, so this, this reminds me of, there's an old, uh, it reminds me of Root Beer Tapper, and it reminds me of another old game called Food Fight. Like, these were old uh, 80s arcade games. And you're just kind of feeding these people pizza. Okay, well, that guy's hungry, stuff a pizza in his face. And he explodes! Now you have to give them more pizza. These people are very hungry. They want their pizza. I think they're kids. Okay, so far this is a pretty harmless FNAF game. This isn't... This is probably the tamest Five Nights at Freddy's game I've ever seen. I think that's Golden Freddy or Fredbear, I'm not sure. Oh, well... Well, give him some more pizza. I'm going got to. two more. Gotta give him the pizza. And I think it takes three for each person. Okay, he yeah, it's three two. for each Oh, he was three? Person. I thought he only took two. I thought... Yeah, I think it's two, actually. No, it's three. Okay. No. Oh, my oh, oh. What's yeah, now it's Shadow, Shadow Freddy. Shadow That's Freddy. Shadow. Well, Do you like pizza or Shadow pizza Freddy's block? purple, so I don't get it why he's gray. Okay, now we got it. Oh, crap. Okay, can we get... You can't get the pizza in their mouths because of Shadow Freddy. I think you have to race him. Okay, he's taking all your pizza. Get up! Oh, he has shot. No, no, ah! No. Uh, but if I go down here and wait and can trick him, and then crap. Okay, so. Okay, so. Um, I don't. Okay, just gotta. Do you want me to try? I can go <laughs> get in there and just like. Oh, he's eating all your pizza. Shadow Freddy is. No, he's all bouncing pizza. it off. Okay. Crap, we don't have any more pizza. There's always more pizza. Yeah, it just infinitely comes. I'm gonna take all the pizza in the world. Just wait for more pizza. Okay, there we go. We got a good stash. Now, quick. Up. Oh. Up, up, up. No, you got it. Um. <clears throat> mm, I don't know. Okay. He's, there you go. So you got to trick him. You got to, like, run him up and then go underneath him or above him. Yeah. Oh, I put on caps. <laughs> Jeez. I am not good at this. This is a very old school game. This is. Like I don't think... I don't... I don't think you could play this on iOS because it's so complicated. It's not really. It's it's actually. But not like complicated. you don't have W 
AS and D and well, shift I, on the iPad. I don't know if they have it for iOS. I even check to see if they have it for iOS. Probably yet. don't. Most of them they bring out for iOS, but I think sister location they even brought out for iOS, so who knows? The possibilities are endless, seriously. Okay. Okay, just go yeah, get, get those guys. There you go. Uh, okay. Sorry about this guys. Okay. I keep hitting caps lock. Okay. Now I'm gonna trick him up here. And then quick. Okay, yeah, one more. One more. One more. And oh crap. I can't so I'll have to make him go down if that's the case. And then quick. Yeah, there we go. Oh we got him. Wait, no, we did. Round four. Wait. Wait, oh, wait, what's wait. He, let's, whoa, 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 wait, wait, what? It's glitching, it's glitching, it's, it's glitching. Um, let's just let it sit here. Um. Oh, you broke it, you broke the computer. It's fine. Um. It's fine, oh. Oh. It's six, baby. I'm scared to touch anything. Um. What do we do? I'm just gonna stare her down. Wait, are we interviewing the animatronics? Yeah, I'm gonna take. I'm giving the headset to Dad because I'm okay. scared. All right, let me see here. Wait, I I think I've. Begin tape. Leaving dead space. Three, two, one. The purpose of this tape is to test automated response times and reactions from vintage interactive attractions following audio stimuli. If you are playing this tape, that means that not only have you been checking outside at the end of every shift as you were instructed to do, but also that you have found something that meets the criteria of your special from obligation. From what I see, Circus Baby doesn't hurt you. Instructions, document Can't response listen. times. Then safely secure the space before leaving. Upon sealing the room, you are not to return. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Okay. Okay, let's mark the responses on the. No. Document results. Nope. Begin audio prompt in three. Two, one. Can she react? No, she didn't. Document results. Nope. Okay. Nope. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Nope. <laughs> so far, this game is a whole lot of confusion. Audio prompt in three. That's what? Two, wait. One. Uh oh. Uh oh. Don't worry, she's. Oh, oh. that. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Don't worry, she doesn't jump scare you from what I've seen. It's a new it's day. It's time to shine. It's time to take I don't your career. Think into I am career. really confused. You saved money your whole life. Great. Now it's time to put all your eggs into one basket and take a huge gamble on your future. It's the same guy from FNAF. Sister location. So now we're watching a commercial. What so we went from a. About? We're talking oh about gosh, FNAF franchise? Too. Are we talking about franchise? Yeah, right. franchise. Restaurant ownership and management. Something almost anyone can do with a limited degree of success. Sure, it's a lot of money to invest, but everyone's doing it. And that means it's safe and lucrative. With your initial investment, you'll receive everything you need to get started, including a small room, some tables, and electricity. So small room, tables, and electricity. Money, left over after money left over. Package. Use it franchise package? Mm. That's a really crappy drawing of Freddy, I'm sorry. More. Now, let's take a look at <coughs> the things that will help you get started as a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee, such as atmosphere, Making sure your establishment has an inviting atmosphere is essential to bringing in new customers. 
Entertainment. Oh, he's wearing Let's Eat, babe. Having a lot of entertainment value in your restaurant will ensure that customers come back. That looks back. like Balloon Boy back there. Bonus revenue. Hmm. Coin-operated games and attractions can generate additional revenue during the day, which means more money in your pocket, ready for reinvestment. Health and safety. There may be times when you purchase something of questionable quality, and we don't blame you. Cutting corners is just good business. But there are steps you can take to ensure you don't get sued for it. And that brings us to liability. Being a thrifty shopper is smart, but be aware that buying things on sale comes with a certain amount of risk. Aside from the daily risk of lawsuits, there's also the risk that something might be hiding inside whatever you hmm. just purchased with that steeply discounted what? price tag. <laughs> what could be hiding course, inside? That would only be a serious danger if there were something outside that's been trying to get in for months now, which we are not confirming to be the case. This concludes the amount of help we are legally obligated to provide. Remember, you are now the face of the newly rebranded Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Wear that smile with pride, and let's make some money. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for disappearance, death, or dismemberment. Okay, then. I'm, I'm sold. Okay, so... Okay, so we have to... So this game is, like, really different. We have to manage our own restaurant now. So this isn't like the normal Freddy survival games. This is interesting. I'm okay. Ready. Let's see how much cash you had left over after purchasing your franchise package. Great, that should be more than enough. Now let's get started. On your left are your product catalogs. You can unlock more expensive catalogs by simply purchasing items for your pizza. Dumpster Diver Weekly. <laughs> Use the arrows in the bottom right of the item window to browse the products for each catalog. When you finish discount shopping, ball pit. click the button labeled Blueprint Mode to place your items. You can switch back and forth between catalog mode and blueprint mode as often as you like before opening your doors to the public. When you're ready to open your restaurant for business for the day, click the button labeled finished in blueprint mode. Give it a try and do some shopping. Okay, <laughs> pick a duck. We didn't get the ball pit. Why didn't we get the ball pit? Okay. Hmm. Put the, put the ducks there. Okay, what else do we got? Playtest. Oh, cool. They're like little mini games. Okay, so we're picking ducks. Do we get like tickets or something? Or um, we get no, money. Just get a faz I, rating. Okay. I think we get sponsorship offer. Oh yeah, we like sponsorship dollars. Ooh. Go to that Blinkins. Yeah, there we go. I don't know. Fizz Time Pop Soda. Have a popping good time with Fizz Time Pop. Fizz Time Pop Inc. is offering to pay for advertising in your establishment. Two hundred fifty bucks. Yeah, we need some money. I guess. Okay, let's try this and see what. Okay, so we got. So, I'm gonna go down, and I'm gonna... Let's play, play test. Okay, Faz rating. <coughs> Take one. Uh, which one do you want? Uh, I like the red one. Wait. Game win! So we won, we won, uh, yeah. Okay, that was uneventful. Um, now what? <laughs> do we let kids in here, or what do we do? Ah, oh, crap. I wasted all my money already. Let's test it. Mm, which one do you think is a 500? Uh, I'm that one. Try that one. This one? Yeah. Nah. Mm. Oh, well. Ah, oh, well. We tried. Ooh, we got 100 bucks. So that means we could... There, play test. Uh, which one do we want? Game win. So wait, we win every time? I don't understand. We win whenever we get a balloon. Okay. Hmm. 
So, let's try this again with the rest of the tokens we have. I mean, we have... How many tokens do we have still? Six. Six. Where did you get that? Right here. It's right up in the corner. Oh, I don't... I... Where's six? I don't see six. Play tokens left. Six. Oh. Hey, we can upgrade the floor plan, too. Let me see here. Okay. Which one do you feel lucky about? Uh, that one. That one? Yep. No. Because I know there are 500 ducks, but we're not getting them today. Okay, here, upgrade the room. $250. See, we got the advertising, so we can upgrade. We don't have it. Yeah, yeah, we do, don't we? We got advertising. We don't have the money. Oh, never mind. Okay. Look. Oh, oh, man. But we have to earn more money, so let's finish and open it. Your restaurant is now officially open. Awesome. That doesn't mean your job is finished, however. You have a lot of work to do while patrons eat their pizza in the other room. From your terminal, you have supplies to buy, papers to print, and repairs I'm just to make. Doing this. Once you've taken care of all the items on your to-do list, get some plates, you can log off for the day and get out of there. Yeah. The money for supplies and repairs comes out of petty cash, so don't worry about it coming out of your pocket. We've got you covered. The only money you have to worry about is if you choose to upgrade any of the equipment in your office. Now, on to other matters. Something to be aware of is that the ventilation system and your terminal are pretty loud okay, is... and may prevent you from hearing Fizz things in adjoining air vents. That won't be a problem if there is nothing in the vents. However, if you mm, feel that something might feels be like a the vents, What the is this? It looks like Pennywise. You it can does. shut off your terminal and the vents. I think it's oh my gosh, I can't, I can't. Increase the amount of attention you are drawing to yourself. Also, shining your light directly into a vent will most likely prevent anything from jumping out. You also have three tools available from the terminal itself. There is a motion detector, an audio decoy, and a secondary ventilation unit. Keep in mind, however, that you can only have one of these active at any given time. Now get to it. Help! Simply log off when you've completed your tasks for the day, and you can go get some coffee. Okay, get those plates, get those napkins. Uh, we want people to have something to eat on at Freddy Fazbear's franchise. Sounds like Mangle. No, it sounds like an old modem. You don't remember that in a ways. That's like before your time. That's like the old dial-up modems. But Mangle has that sound too. Okay, so... Okay. Gotta get the supplies, get the pizza kits. Okay, then you're almost done with that task. Get some flyers. We're gonna get some ammo. Let's see. Just check to see if there's anything in there. Hmm. No. Ah, I always haven't. A little touchy. This game's a little touchy, I think. Yeah, it's very touchy. These drawings are really good, though. But what's with Chica? Okay, let's print some menus. Okay, I think I got it now, Dad. I'm just not gonna touch that poster again. Well, no, you just have to make sure you keep the keep the mouse centered. He's still scanning. Hmm. Okay, Dad, I think I have it now. Can I, can okay, I use it? Okay, we got it? our supplies. Wait, we got advertising. The, we gotta get the menus yet. Can, can I have the mouse back? Well, this is taking forever. And maintenance. We're unclogging our toilet using our computer. Hmm. Okay, so let's, is there anything? So. Okay. 
So we're getting our supplies. Hey, I think I got the hang of the mouse. Okay, good. Yeah, you have to keep the mouse centered or it's gonna be really crazy. Okay, all my tasks done, so how do we log off? Oh crap. Um do vent. Oh, my God. Great job. Okay. It looks like you're getting the hang of this. Okay. Now let's Look at all the money we're going to get. You through your first week. There's a big party here Saturday, and you should view that day as your ultimate test. Make it through Saturday, and you will have proven yourself as the successful entrepreneur that we all know you can be. Congratulations on completing your first day. However, your job isn't over just yet. There is another aspect to your mm. end of day routine. Oh no. And that is inspecting and salvaging any animatronics found in the alley outside the back door. Okay. Things are found here quite often. And while we aren't sure why, what we do know is that they can be used for parts, which can mean a much needed revenue boost before starting your next day. Of course, as with everything else in this line of work, those benefits come with risk. The safest thing to do is to throw it back outside, but then you get no money for the salvage. <laughs> Choose to keep it, and you run the risk of certain negative consequences. Negative Namely, consequences? Death, should the item in question not be as docile as it first appeared. Hmm. If you do decide to try to salvage it, then you must complete the maintenance It's fun time for you guys. During this testing phase, Check on the animatronic frequently. If you feel that it is becoming unstable, use the taser provided to you. You can use it three times without damaging the hardware. Every use over three, however, will decrease the item's salvage value. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as salvage, or if you choose to, you can throw it back into the alley where you found it and forfeit payment. Please make your choice now. Uh, uh what do you want to do? What do you want to do? I don't know. What do you want to do? Uh, we can try to salvage it. I don't think that's a good idea. Because okay, Freddy's seen, in sister location from what I've seen, Freddy's the most aggressive. Should we throw Freddy back out in the alley? Yep. Goodbye, Freddy. Don't forget Saturday. You want them all Saturday. to be in one place. Oh, we got a happy free. No lawsuits. Good, because we threw Freddy back in the alley. <laughs> so, okay, so let's see what else we can get. I wouldn't get we that. We need a ball pit. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, but it has a liability want. risk. <sighs> There's nothing else to buy. Oh, what's that? Yeah, we can get that. Wait, hold on. I want to see what else. Hmm. Mr. Hugs. Mr. Hugs. Bucket Bob and Bucket Bob, Mr. Mr. Candy. Candy. So these are garbage. These Number are garbage Number one tier. crate. Yeah, these are garbage animatronics because we don't have a lot of money. It's a light Pan stand. Paper, paper pals! Let's get some paper pals. Ooh, stand. So we don't have a lot of money right now, so we're buying garbage, garbage tier uh, animatronics. They're made from like junk lying around. <laughs> They're not the good animatronics. But we didn't want Freddy because we're afraid Freddy will kill us. That's like Pac-Man. I don't have any more money. Okay, well let's try running, running it today. Today's Saturday. Mm -hmm. Okay. There's our. Wait, I don't know pals. if it is Saturday or not. Okay, let's put that arcade machine down here somewhere. There we go. Oh, cool. We can do... Oh, yeah. It's like Pac-Man. But with a girl. Fruity Maze. Wait, look on the back screen. Oh. You can see a face. I'm scared of... Oh, is that... Is that our face? <laughs> is that supposed to be us looking down in the screen? I don't know. This is like one of the cocktail arcade machines. Uh, when I was a kid, they had these, a lot of restaurants and stuff had these, where you could basically just sit down. Yeah, I think it's supposed to be your face. Is your plan. 
yeah, these these old games like they had Pac-Man and Galaga, and you could you know get like a, a Coke or something and sit down and play. Um, some of the restaurants that we used to go to when I was a kid had these. She scares me. <laughs> Ah. I'm taking that. Okay. <laughs> I don't think anything scary is going to happen. Okay, we're good. We okay. have $100, too. And we still have $100. Bucks. Okay. Oh, another sponsorship offer. Let's let's go see what we got. Marty's Plungers. Nothing goes down that can't come up. Marty's Plungers, LLC. is up. Yeah. I, I say take all the ad dollars we can get. It's like YouTube advertising, right? You just get all the money you can get. Look, we got an upgrade. You upgraded the place, so now we actually have real floors. Hey, this is pretty cool. Okay, so, um, okay, so let's, um, oh, you clean polished it. Mm -hmm. Okay, are we gonna, are we gonna try to get through Saturday? Um, we're gonna try, because at least we didn't get, decide to get any animatronics. Not yet. Because we can't, and we didn't salvage Freddy, so he can't run loose. Okay, so let's let's finish and let's see if we can get through Saturday then. I think we can. Unless some Can weird... we get through Saturday in Five Nights at Freddy's Part 6? What's that noise? Okay. I don't know. Did we get through? Okay, we got to order stuff. Wait, I'm going to order the cups. Okay. Hopefully we have a good I'm Saturday. still wondering what's wrong with Chica. Like, why does she Chica, have lipstick and blue Chica cheeks? looks like Big Bird in, in drag. Okay. Alright, let's... There's a lot more going on in this game than the other Freddy's games. The other Freddy's games, you basically just had to look around for animatronics. This one, you have to kind of look over your shoulder while you're uh, building a business. <laughs> That's kind of, kind of fun. See if we can get through Saturday. If we get through Saturday, I think that's a good place to stop the video. Yeah. And then we'll, we'll. I think Saturday's where it ends the first night, basically. Okay. Well, we'll see because that was supposed to be our big day. So let's. Okay. We ordered pizza kits. Let's see if there's anything. And uh, nope, we're good. Okay. Still let's scanning. Keep ordering. Let's get some average. Let's get some more flyers. We're printing out. That's an old old printer. Seriously, people. I thought we. Just didn't do the advertisement anymore. Where is my task? Um, I don't know. Oh, there we go. Okay. My question is, why is that really creepy drawing there? Like the one with the gray bear and the big black, big red bow tie? I don't know. And why does Freddy have a purple hat and purple bow tie now? And why is his mouth wide open? And why does Foxy look evil in that drawing? And why do they all have stars on them? I don't know. That's a good... Uh, is it mustard? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, they have <laughs> stars. That is different. Why do they have stars on them? Because they didn't have stars before. Um, it's a five-star restaurant. I don't know. No, except for all the deaths. Hmm. And whatever happened here. Okay. Is there anybody coming? Nobody's coming. Okay, we're unclogging the toilets now. I'm gonna get the poop out of the toilets in the Freddy's Pizzeria, because can't nobody wants poopy toilets. Clean the ovens. So how are we? How, it, this is like in the eighties. How are we doing all this stuff on a computer? Well, they had computers that works in the 80s. really good. They they had computers in the eighties. They were just very old school. 
I don't but this know if it's one the 80s or 90s. This is going to be early 90s, too. It could know. be 2000, actually, because no. the first pizzeria was in the 90s. Well, if it's a franchise, yeah, I don't know. Okay, well, we're done with everything. So, I'm going to log off. Okay, let's see how we did. And then we'll uh, wrap it up after this. And then we'll play some more another day. So Hopefully, if we survive. <laughs> we didn't bring Can Freddy. you survive these okay. nights? Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. Oh, um, another animatronic. Sure of its origins. It is your job to complete now the maintenance checklist before claiming uh, it as salvage. Spring trap now? Spring trap? You can throw it back into the alley. Uh-huh. And forfeit payment. Please I don't trust now. spring trap. Yeah, let's throw them all out. <laughs> I'm gonna keep Ballora though. Circus Baby and Ballora, I'm keeping because Circus Baby didn't do anything mean yeah. to us. Well, at some point, at some point, we're probably gonna have to bring the animatronics in to make more money, and then that's when things are gonna get scary. But they're light animatronics. No lawsuits today, man. Good job. Okay, well. Oh, we're on Wednesday already. How did that happen? Yesterday was Saturday, and we're on Wednesday. Wow. Okay. Well, I think we're gonna. I think we're gonna wrap the video up on this, and we'll we'll play some more. Goodbye. Um. Yeah. We didn't get any jump scares in this video, but that's that's good. So <laughs> try not to get any jump scares. Okay. Uh, subscribe to the channel. We're gonna put, post some more uh, uh, Five Nights at Freddy's six videos uh, in the next few days. So goodbye. I'm jamming out to the music.